Ignaz Semmelweis, was a Hungarian doctor working in Vienna General Hospital in the 19th century. In 1846 he wondered why so many women were dying of childbed fever at the time. Semmelweis noted that mothers who were tended by midwives had a far lower rate of death and fever than those tended by doctors. It was a golden age of medicine where doctors started trying to learn what caused illness by doing autopsies. It was a point of pride for doctors to walk around in their coats from the last autopsy or surgery they performed, after which they headed straight to the maternity ward to do their shift delivering babies. Based on this observation, Semmelweis developed a theory that those performing autopsies got cadaveric matter on their hands, which they then carried from the autopsy room into the maternity ward. In 1847, Semmelweis introduced mandatory rules for doctors and students to wash their hands in a chlorine and lime solution, and the rate of death dropped dramatically. He literally saved lives with three words. Wash your hands. His theory was not popular with many other doctors and was rejected and ridiculed. Semmelweis kept pushing his theory, some say he was obsessed with it. Eventually he was taken to a mental institution, where he was beaten and died two weeks later from a blood infection, in August 1865. The importance of hand washing for medical professionals didn't really become understood until scientists hit upon germ theory, the idea that certain diseases and infections are caused by microorganisms we can't even see. In particular, in the 1870s, the British surgeon Joseph Lister drastically improved patient mortality by advocating that surgeons wash their hands and sterilize their instruments in between patients. Today, medical and health professionals consider hand washing a critical hygienic practice, both for themselves and their patients. More than a century after Semmelweis's theories were mocked, the Medical University of Budapest changed its name to Semmelweis University in honor of his unsung persistence to improve healthcare through cleanliness.